Hey guys, Tammy here with Long for the Ride, and today is a big shopping day for us. Um, I have got to go to Sam's Club, Walmart, gonna be a huge haul day. And, as you can see, I am alone. They let me out of the house alone today, so I think I'm just gonna shop till I drop. So I thought I'd take you along with me. Let's get this done. Got this little beauty. I may need this after holiday shopping. Should give it away. Not sure I will. These are on clearance for nine dollars. Boy, these are cozy. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. They actually have disinfecting wipes in stock. Limit one. Oh, Santa needs to bring me one of those. Does anybody else go Christmas shopping and end up wanting to shop for yourself? Or is it just me? Because of the holidays. And of course, toilet paper is sold out. These are the best for holiday meals. One of the best prices on chips. All right, guys. So it's lunchtime. Shopping's hard work makes you hungry, and I try to eat low carb or keto as much as possible. Now today I'm out on the run. Today I'm out on the run shopping, and I don't really want to eat a bunch of junk or crap. So um, I like to go to Wendy's and drive through Wendy's. They are really good about um, giving you a burger on a lettuce wrap or no bun. In fact, there's a lot of ways you can modify when you eat out um, as far as trying to make it more low carb or keto friendly. So I'll show you what I order. It's pretty yummy. Hi, thank you for choosing Wendy's. What can I get you started with today? Okay, I want the bacon jalapeno burger in a lettuce wrap or with no bun. Do you want the combo or just the sandwich? Just the sandwich, please. Okay, what else are you? That's it. 608. Thanks. So Wendy's does a pretty good job providing keto options. So it's a lettuce wrap burger. You can either pick it up with the lettuce around it, or they also do give you a fork. So, pretty yummy. I mean, it's not perfect. There are some little fried onions on there, which probably have some carbs, but it's low carb. Every little bit helps. All right, next stop is Walmart pickup. All right, guys, so just got home from Sam's Club and Walmart pickup. Got a huge grocery haul unloaded, and I want to go through it and show you what we got. All right, so as you can see, we have lots of apples. I ordered apples on my Walmart pickup and also went to Sam's and I went to Sam's Club first and then I kind of remembered what I had on my Walmart order but then whatever I kind of forgot so I bought more apples at Sam's Club but we have had like an apple crisis shortage in the house which is a good thing to have my boys have been eating apples like crazy I bought 20 pounds of apples on my Azure standard grocery haul. I thought, oh yeah, I'm gonna have plenty of apples because we do carrot and apple juice and kids eat apples as a snack and like they were gone in no time. I need to plant an orchard or something. Anyway, this is a good problem to have. My kids are eating tons of apples. I haven't even been able to do carrot juice because I haven't had enough apples to do a ratio of correctly. Halos, these little oranges. My, my kids love to snack on those. Let's just start over here with the, the fruits. Tons of bananas, actually, not really tons. We got four bunches, but again, my boys will run through the bananas like crazy. Another good problem to have. Baby carrots and green peppers. 
We like to do a veggie tray and do a little bit of ranch in the middle and slice up green peppers and baby carrots. Got a couple things of tater tots. Um, I've done some freezer meals, tater tot casserole. I have some other new recipes coming up that I want to try with tater tots and breakfast casseroles and stuff like that. So those are going in the freezer. Pepperoni and lunch meat. Walmart was out of the big thing of pepperoni. Lots of pepperoni. The kids love pepperoni on their sandwiches with lunch meat. Pepper jack cheese. I think we're going to do a meat and cheese tray. My son has some deer sausage, so we're going to slice that up for Christmas and do a meat and cheese tray. Breakfast sausage just for the freezer. Big thing of cheese. If you've watched my prior grocery hauls, I normally prefer to grate my cheese off the block, but with holidays and crazy time and busy, I'm going to cheat and take some shortcuts just because who's got time for that now, right? All right, Go-Gurt. I tried to buy the Simply Go-Gurt, hoping that's a little better, um, but my kids will eat this for a snack all the time. These sweet kale um, vegetable salad kits are great. We're going to use these when we have our holiday meal together. Got a couple of those. One really isn't enough, so we are going to have that as a side dish. Cinnamon rolls. We'll have some cinnamon rolls Christmas morning for breakfast. Zarda beans. We have a meal planned with family and need a big thing of beans, so Zarda beans from Sam's Club are pretty good. Butterfly shrimp. We have a bunch of boiled shrimp in the freezer. One of the holiday meals we have planned for Christmas Eve is to do boiled shrimp and butterfly shrimp and baked potato and not even sure what else we got on the menu. I'd have to go back and think about that. But anyway, half and half and I ordered that for a recipe and now I gotta remember what that was for. <laughs> anyway, um, cheesecake, probably gonna use that for a dessert for one of our meals. I keep plenty of that in the pantry anyway, just in case it's always a dessert everybody loves. So, and just some cream style corn. We're, whoop, I think I've got four cream style corn. With the cream style corn and the Jiffy corn mix, I'm gonna make a, make a corn casserole. All right, back here we've just got some pasta to put in the pantry. Just restocking tomato sauce, marinara sauce, pasta sauce, cereal. Try to buy the organic if I can. My son likes these little chocolate loops, so got those. And then organic great value frosted flakes. Those are pretty yummy. Picked up some pecan halves at Sam's. These are great. I like to just munch on them. They're low carb and a good healthy snack. Got several bags of chips at Sam's Club. These bags I think were like $2.50 a bag. That's a pretty good deal for chips for members mark. So we've got the barbecue and a couple bags of wavy. Back here we have a couple things of Hawaiian rolls. Like I said, I'm going to do some sliders and my kids make sandwiches on Hawaiian rolls. So those go pretty quickly. And as you can see back here, we have more toilet paper to add to our prepper pantry stock. So did I talk about the meat yet? I don't remember if I talked about the meat. I did say breakfast sausage. Got some ground beef. Um, Sam's Club has organic ground beef, 85% lean, 15% fat. So I went ahead and grabbed a three pack of that. I think it was like almost, it was four something a pound. Not the greatest, but we try to eat as clean as possible whenever we can. Can't do perfect, but I try to make choices, the better choices whenever I can. It all adds up. And then back here we have some chicken thighs. And I think those are even the, hmm, they should be, the Never Any antibiotic. Yeah, they're the Never Any. So at least they're not organic, but it's Never Any added hormones and antibiotics. No antibiotics ever. Fed all the vegetarian diet, so I feel like that's a little better choice than maybe not. So we go with that. Oh, there's the almonds. I knew I got a couple bags of nuts. Well, almonds and pecans are good finger food. Good healthy snack, especially for me, low key, low carb. So I try to snack on them instead of alternatives that are not the best. Okay, where was we? Oh, as you can, speaking of low carb and low sugar, and then here we go. It's the holidays. Um, I was planning on we we're gonna do cookies for Santa. We normally do homemade sugar cookies, but then I seen this and I was like, oh, that's really tempting. So, we are probably going to cheat this year and not do, I don't know, I haven't decided yet. 
We have options. If not, we'll keep it back, but you never know what wrench life will throw you, and it's nice to have a quick backup in case we need it. So anyway, sugar cookie mix. We're going to decorate cookies for Christmas, and behind that, I got a little carried away in this category, um, brownie mix. We're probably going to have brownies for dessert for one of the meals when we get together with everybody. So grab those. And also some no-bake cookie dough bites. So I have some options for some quick, easy desserts over the holidays. I would prefer to do them homemade, healthier, better, but let's be real. It's the holidays and things are crazy and I wanted to have these backup options in case life doesn't go as planned. All right, and over here, what do we have here? These are from Walmart Pickup. We have a little, um, we do a, a gift exchange, a, like where you draw a number and then another number, everybody draws a number, and then the person who drew the number before gets to go take that person's gift, et cetera, et cetera. So I needed a few little gifts for that game. Um, these seemed cute. So this one's a cast iron brownie mix baking kit. And this little one is the cast iron chocolate chip cookie mix. Oh, five bucks each. So I thought those would make little odds and ends, good little odds and ends gifts. Same with the holiday, the Sock Monkey Holiday Cocoa Mix Set. Double chocolate cocoa mix and candy canes. So I thought this would make a cute little gift to fill in in times like that that are needed. Um, moving on, just got some medicines to stock back up. It's a good idea to always have plenty and keeping our pantry. Almost all of my kids are now on to adult medicine. My youngest still prefers the liquid, children's liquids, so I try to keep what he prefers because when you're sick, I make life as easy as possible. All right, and pick these up at Sam's Club. These premium plastic plates are excellent for holiday dinners. We just use them and then throw them away. There's 48 plates here, 24 seven and a half inch plates and 24 10 and a quarter inch plates so that works great it'll step up from a paper plate but then you don't have to wash dishes win-win oh and speaking of another little gift um pick this up at sam's club aromatherapy shower burst tablets in fact in fact it's pretty tempting after the holidays to want to keep this for myself yeah it's gonna be hard to give that one up. We shall see. All right, and then we've got over here some zero sugar Coke, just for a special treat on the holidays. And then my little standard staple favorite strawberry flavored cream, Russell Stover's. Okay, and then back here, grab some wine at Sam's Club, because it's the holidays and need wine. If you are a wine drinker, I'd like to talk about, this is my favorite wine by Bonterra, and, and it's, Mostly because it's made with organic grapes. I try to choose organic as much as possible whenever I can. Um, I realize it's not perfect, but I do feel like it's better than a wine with grapes sprayed with all kinds of pesticides. So they make this wine in the Cabernet and also there's several varieties of white wines. So you gotta check them out if you like wine and you're concerned about the ingredients in your wine, check it out. We'll set some of them back in the prepper pantry. And of course, don't remember if I mentioned disinfecting wipes. Sam's Club actually had disinfecting wipes, so I went ahead and grabbed some. So I think I've covered everything. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like. Consider subscribing to our channel, and I will see you in our next video.